In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the title command in Minecraft Bedrock. So the first thing you want to do is you want to load into your Minecraft world and make sure that cheats are enabled. Afterwards, you want to go ahead and give yourself a command block if you haven't already. So this is the command slash give at P and then command underscore block just like so. All right, then you want to go ahead and place on your command block where you want the message to appear. Then afterwards, you want to select on your command block. Make sure that where it says block type that it is set to impulse, unconditional, and it needs redstone. Now here is time for the command. So what you want to do is you want to do slash type title and then at p which represents closest player and then you want to go ahead and type in title one more time and then afterwards you want to type in whatever title you want but you guys could actually include this special character over here uh like the squiggly line which you can find in the description down below in order to copy and paste it but basically this will allow you to add color to your title and so it's double squiggly line and if we put like a letter for example like a or like b or v or something like that it is actually going to change the color based on what you enter so that's honestly pretty cool and if you want to make your title um you know in bold you can go ahead and press on l just like so and then type out your actual message so i'm just going to go ahead and put test title right over here obviously you can go ahead and name it whatever you want you can change the colors if you would like you can make it bold etc and there's honestly a lot of great things but once you're done with that all you want to do is you want to go ahead and exit out of it just like so all right then what you want to do is you want to go ahead and take out a button in order to actually activate this command block all right, and whenever we go ahead and press on it, you will now notice that we will get this title screen over here, and it honestly does look pretty good. Remember, you can go ahead and adjust it at any point in time. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next tutorial.